Hey guys, what's happening? It's Irish iPhone Tutorials and today I'm going to do another kind of series and um, this one is going to be the top three winterboard themes. Now, I'll probably only do this once but um, yeah, it's going to be the top three winterboard themes that are out at the minute on Cydia and uh, they've been out for a while so you guys might know some of them. But this is just my opinion, of course it's very hard to choose but uh, these are the top three that I've used a lot so without further ado, let's get in right to the video. Alright guys, coming in at the number 3 spot is the not so famous uh, Prestige HD. Uh, I'm sure a lot of you guys have heard of it before, but I'm going to put it in the video anyways. Now this team is really a piece of art. In my opinion it is one of the best teams out in City at the minute, if not the best. The reason it's a number 3 spot is because it's been out for a while and a lot of guys probably know about it. And I used to use it, I used it for about half a year. So as you can see at the start, it just looks pretty sick in general. I'm just going to go through them briefly, guys. So as you can see, all the icons are small. They're really clean with a really clean font. That's the key to having a good team, I think, is having a clean font and uh, having really clean icons. Now the background is just simple gray, but uh, the icons and everything makes up for it. Now this team is really, really in-depth. Everywhere you go, you'll be finding new things that... Um, the developer has put into the team. I believe the developer's name is Seven. It's like S E Seven E N. But for example, if I go into like music, uh, as you can see, it has custom loading screens for nearly every app, and uh, it also has custom sliders there for the volume and custom buttons. Everywhere you pretty much go in this team, you're gonna find something that's custom, because. Uh, the developer has really put a lot of work into the team. So that's the number three spot, and that is Prestige HD, guys. Okay, guys, coming in to number two spot is a team called Icon or Acon. Um, you guys have probably heard of that as well. It's another theme that's been out for a while, but I'm going to review it anyway. So as you can see at the start here, there's a custom slider, thin little button, and a custom camera button there. So once you slide off, you'll be greeted by a lot of nice icons with loads of detail, like the video icon for there, it's pretty sick. Uh, overall, there's a lot of icons in this team, and like Prestige HD, wherever you go, there's going to be a lot of custom things to follow. So once again, I'll just head on into music and just wait for this to change. As you can see here, it's nice uh, black kind of... There's transparent bars up here, and if you slide across, you can see it's a sort of silver bar that follows it. Uh, all the buttons are custom as well. There's no loading screens for this app, I believe. But overall, it is a pretty goddamn awesome theme. Lots of icons to be included in it. And uh, if you guys are ever missing any icons, you can just use Team Icon Maker. So that's Acon. Um, it has a custom notification center, I believe. Um, if you go through the scene fully, you will find all the custom things in it. But uh, there is a lot of stuff in there. If I just head on into Winterboard for a second um, and scroll down, there's a lot of switches activated in this. As you can see, there's all the switches like the phone, messages, lock screen and all that. So I'll just go into the phone to show you guys. As you can see, custom dial pad there. And uh, yeah, so that is Icon, guys. Okay guys, coming in at the number one spot, you'll probably be surprised, but uh, the theme is called Flight. Now, what this is, is an Icons theme. It doesn't actually have any other stuff to do with it. Now, if you're like me, I like just plain simple themes. I don't like them really fancy, so in my opinion, that's why I give the number one spot. It just changes the icons, and they're really sick, sort of matte effect, all the icons. Uh, once again, if you're missing any, you can use Team Icon Maker. But uh, that is pretty much it guys, there's nothing else to show you on this apart from the icons. They're all pretty sick and there's lots of them in the team. So I hope you guys enjoyed this series. Uh, leave a like if you did. Probably be one of the only videos I'm going to do of it, depending on how it goes down. But um, I guess I'll see you guys later. Bye.